everyone, welcome to the video. Today I'm going to be showing you how to build a grandfather clock super easy in Minecraft. Before we get started, if you could subscribe, that would help out so much. And yeah, let's get on with the video. Okay, so this is the clock design. Now, obviously there are a few things that can be changed here. So like this thing at the top, you can add a slab or a daylight sensor or something. You know, it can be something thicker if you want it to be. But I always just use the trapdoor because it looks a little better and it's a little lower. And like this glass, it can also just be the normal glass. It does not have to be the white tainted, tainted, <laughs> tinted. It can be like any other color if you want it to be, but I'm just using this because I feel like that's the simplest for now. Okay, so these are the things you're going to need for this build. You are gonna need a piston and a block of, or like a piston and then something to power that piston. It doesn't have to be a block of redstone, it can be almost anything. Um, and then like some sort of just block to like help you place it basically. So there's these three. Uh, but then you're going to need some sort of glass. It can just, as long as it's a block, that's fine. Um, and then, again, like I said, like, these things can be changed, like, the colors if you want it to be. But you do need an armor stand and gold boots, a clock, and then an item frame. Those are the things that you kind of definitely need. If you do want to make the item frame clear, though, you can watch my other video on how to get an invisible item frame. And it actually, if you want that, then it might look a little bit better just because it's clear. But you don't have to do that. It's not necessary. And plus, you have to be in creative mode to get the clear one so yeah so starting off we're going to place a stair facing like this and then you can go ahead and place your three trap doors one two three and then one two three and you can flip them all up like this next thing is to go ahead and take your armor stand place it facing to the side so make sure it's not like this or I mean it can be if you you want it to be but to, for it to look like that you gotta do it to the side like that and then go ahead and place your boots on okay so now what you're going to do is you're just going to place your glass you can use just a block to build up it has to be the block in front of it right here and what you're going to do is you're going to place some some other form of blocks right there with the piston facing inward like that so it pushes the block and then you can place your power source or whatever you want just make sure that the piston is powered and it will push that block into the armor stand just like this. So then you can just go ahead and place your trapdoor, whatever you're using as that top block on top. And this is the only hard part, so what you're gonna do is place a block here and then place your stairs facing up. And then you can just remove this block and then stack up so that the piston faces inward just like that we did before. And you can just get rid of those, they aren't necessary, they're just to build up the piston. And then place your set power source you know, so it powers the piston, and then it should push it in. I know from this angle, it shows a little bit of the top, but like from here, you cannot see that. And last but not least, the final thing is to just shift and place your item frame, or your invisible one, whichever one you decide to do, and then go ahead and place your clock in the item frame, and there you go. Now the clock will actually go by the time, so obviously, right now, it's in the morning basically but if we go ahead and set the time to midnight then that clock obviously it switched right in front of our eyes it's gonna switch over to whatever it is so it does actually work and function as a clock it's not just for decoration thank you all so much for watching i hope you enjoyed if you did go ahead and like comment and share the video as well as subscribe check out my merch at teespring.com slash store slash foosball 19 and I know the holidays are coming up, so if you have stuff you want to get for family members, go ahead and do that now because it is the perfect time to get it. And yeah, that's all I have for you. I hope you enjoyed. Bye!